On June 19th, Delhi's Saftarjang IMD Observatory recorded its highest ever minimum temperature since 1969 at 35.2 degrees Celsius. North India, which is currently reeling under a heat wave, also had other stations like Alwar, Lakhimpur Kheri and Varanasi breaking records with their nighttime temperatures of 33 degrees Celsius, highest ever in their observatories. Hello and welcome to The Print. I am Akanksha Mishra and today we will be discussing what are nighttime temperatures or minimum temperatures, how are they determined and how they affect people's health. Minimum temperatures, as the name suggests, mean the minimum temperature level recorded during a day, which is also known as nighttime temperature because lower temperatures usually tend to occur at night after the sun has set. Now, normally at night, the ground starts to cool down because of the lack of solar rays and radiation of heat, which also leads to the atmosphere cooling down as hot air rises above. The average nighttime temperatures in June in Delhi range between 25 to 28 degrees Celsius, as is seen by historic minimum temperature data from 2011 to 2023 given by the IMD. However, in June 2024, the average nighttime temperature in Delhi over the past 19 days has been 30.6 degrees Celsius. This high minimum temperature corresponds with the high maximum temperature that is recorded across Delhi, Haryana, Punjab and Uttar Pradesh with all the places reaching 40 to 45 degrees Celsius daily. In the last week, the nighttime temperature in Delhi has consistently been above 31 degrees Celsius, which is termed as a warm night. This is when nighttime temperatures are 5 degrees higher than normal. On 20th June, however, the nighttime temperature in Delhi reduced drastically from the last night to 29.6 degrees Celsius. The normal night temperature, according to IMD, is 27.2 degrees Celsius and Wednesday's record in Saftarjang was 8 degrees higher than that. The last time that the observatory recorded such a high temperature was in 1972 in May when it was 34.9 degrees Celsius. We have to keep in mind that while the Saftarjung Observatory is seen as representative of all of Delhi, other observatories in the city have recorded higher temperatures too. Why is nighttime temperature important? The IMD explains how a high nighttime temperature has a cascading effect on the day's temperatures too. If the minimum temperature is high, then the next day's maximum temperature will be attained earlier. It's only logical that it will take a shorter period of time to go from 35 degrees to 40 degrees Celsius as opposed to from 27 to 40 degrees Celsius. Another significant effect of the nighttime temperature is on the human body. In summers, when day temperatures are very high, the body needs the night to cool down in a relatively lower temperature. However, when the minimum temperature remains almost as high as the day temperature, this increases heat stress on the body. The heat discomfort increases and nighttime is no longer conducive to rest and relief for the body. Especially during a heat wave, when the body and its organs are already undergoing stress during the day and are dehydrated and tired, cooler night temperatures are essential. Dr. Sumit Ray of Holy Family Hospital, Delhi, spoke to the print about the changes in the body during heat stress. During a heat wave, when the ambient temperature is very high, the body is struggling to maintain its own normal temperature of 37 degrees Celsius. It gets very exhausted and the cooler temperatures at night are to let the body's system rest and regain its energy. But when the ambient temperature remains high even at night, for your body, it's like running a constant marathon because there's no time for rest for your organs. He also added how the heart, kidneys and other mechanisms of energy production in the body are affected by heat stress. The real-time effect is also visible in data reported from the National Centre for Disease Control, which shows 110 heat wave deaths in the country this year from March to June. There have been studies, including a Lancet study in 2022, that found that globally, vulnerable people were exposed to 3.1 billion more heatwave days in 2021 as compared to 2025, and heat-related deaths increased by 68% in the same period. What are some purported reasons for the heatwave and the high nighttime temperatures in northern and northwestern India right now? 
The first reason is the delayed advancement of the monsoon. According to Akshat Deoras, research scientist at the National Center for Atmospheric Sciences. As the western disturbances that bring the southwest monsoon are delayed, the region is experiencing higher than normal temperatures. The westerly winds from arid regions like Rajasthan and Pakistan are blowing over northern India and they are warm and dry which contribute to the heat waves. Mahesh Pallavat, who is the vice president of meteorology and climate change at SkyMet Weather, also explains that there are no large water bodies that can add to the humidity and cause pre-monsoon rain over this region. It cannot be said that it is only the impact of climate change that has caused this heat wave because that would require a trend analysis of over 10 years. But we also cannot ignore the signatures of climate change, global warming, increased greenhouse gas emissions and new heat wave and cold wave records that are broken every year. However, for the next 6 days Till 27 June, the IMD has predicted no heat wave conditions over Delhi, and it has also flagged the abatement of heat wave conditions in parts of Punjab, Uttar Pradesh, and Haryana because of the incoming western disturbances. This is Akanksha Mishra. For more such analysis, follow the print on our social media.